In this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to put in references and citations in an APA document using Word 2010 and Reference Point Software's template. So say I'm right here in my document. I need to cite an author and say the author is in a journal. So I click Journal, type in the name of the author. I didn't capitalize that, but the software did it for me. It also put in the period. Now say I needed some other information, like say I used the web version of this article. I could put in the DOI information, I could put in the web information. But for this example I'm just going to click Save and now it's prompting me to put in the citation and I want to use this style right here I'm going to click OK and now here is my citation and if I scroll down to the reference page it should be there here's the reference page and the properly formatted item now let me just show you some other cool stuff since you have a minute. I should put a period in there to end my sentence. But suppose I needed to cite Wikipedia, which I'm sure a lot of you guys do. We've got one for that, and look how easy this is. Just put in the word. If I wanted to double check that I've got the right address there, I hit, hit the check mark. It goes out to Wikipedia, and sure enough, that is the correct address. I'm going to close that. I just need, I looked at it today, so T for today. And I'm going to click Save. And once again, it's offering to put in the citation information for that article. I'm going to just hit Cancel here. But if I go back down to my reference page, here I have a site a reference for Wikipedia the word that I looked up I didn't know the date it had last been edited but here's the date I retrieved it from Wikipedia now that's very important with Wikipedia because Wikipedia changes frequently and items that change frequently you should include the date that you viewed the item All right, if you're not totally bored yet, I've got some other little hints to show you about capitalization and names. I'm going to click on Journal, so you could click on any of these. And our software does a pretty good job of capitalizing for you. Notice it even did Vanderstump properly. It put in the commas, put in the periods, put in the ampersand. Maybe I didn't want a D there, I meant to type an E. Just click on that little thing there, right here, and you can go in and change it. Now here's a really esoteric little hint. Back in this name thing, in the APA manual, 6th edition, there's this example of an author, actually an artist, who does not capitalize her name. KD Lang. So in that rare instance, you can turn this off. And when I type Lang K K D, it comes out properly capitalized. Just another little item to save you time, and that's what our goal is.